Hi everyone and welcome to your practice today. We're looking at organic energy which is the fifth principle of Anusara Yoga. So we've already looked at opening to grace and muscular energy and muscular energy and organic energy go hand in hand and we try to balance them out as we work through our practice. And in this time we are coming out of lockdown quite slowly and during lockdown we were kind of contracted we were at home we couldn't really do much so that really is our muscular energy where we draw in on ourselves we draw in on the bones of our body we find strength in that and now we're beginning to um move out again and maybe go out go out to for meals or go places and that's like our muscular energy but we have to look after ourselves too so we have to draw in on our inner light as well as shine out so if we don't do both um, it becomes imbalanced so today's class we are looking at organic energy but we'll also be hugging in first and finding that energy drawing it into our god into our core of our body before we can shine it out so take your seat and sit up either in cross-legged sit up on something a cushion a block and sit nice and tall so that you're stacking your spine shoulders over your hips your head over your shoulders you're not leaning forward or back just feel that you're balanced on your sit bones left to right front to back and when you feel that balance then close your eyes And begin to notice your breath. Find a balance between your inhale and your exhale. That one isn't any longer or fuller than the other. Exhale fully. And now we breathe in for the count of four. Two, three, four, and hold. Two, three, four, exhale. Two, three, four, and hold. Two, three, four, inhale. Two, three, four, hold. Two, three, four, exhale. So two, three, four, and hold the breath in for two, three, four. Inhale, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four, and hold the breath out, two, three, four. Do another two rounds, just like that. All parts of the breath are balanced. All parts of the breath are working together. And then release that practice after your last exhale. And notice what you've created by just a little bit of breath work of pranayama practice. Bring your hands together in front of your heart. And we begin our practice with the sound of one arm. Exhale fully. Take a breath in. open your eyes bring your right fingertips to the floor lift your left arm up and side bend over to the right let's begin by waking up our spine in all directions inhale reach both arms up exhale lift, length, left hand down right arm reaches and 
side bend over to the left. Inhale and lift up. Exhale, release your hands behind. Press into your fingertips, gentle back bend, lift your heart. And then walk your hands forward and come into a forward fold. Inhale and lift up and change the crossing of your legs and place the other leg in front. And bring your left hand to your right knee, right hand either to the floor behind or to your lower back. Look forward, so don't come into the twist just yet and twist from the back of your left um, ribs. Twist from there, twist from the back body around towards the right. Move up through the back, the back of the left shoulder and then finally the head turns. through center and to the left and again initiate the twist from the back of your right the right lower back twist around to the left the back of the right ribs twists around to the to the left and when we do that there's a softness in our twist so initiate it from the back the head is the last thing to twist Inhale, come back to centre. And let's make our way to hands and knees. If you have any cushions, you can bring them out to the side. You'll need a block and a belt, but if you don't have them, a book or a, and a scarf, perfect. Come to hands and knees and spread your fingers. Take a moment to settle. That's our opening to grace. Feel, it, feel your foundation, spread your fingers. And now engage all the muscles. Hug your arms towards each other. Hug to a midline. Let's do a few cat-cows. Inhale, lift your heart. Lift your head, lift your sit bones. And as you exhale around, draw in. This is our contraction, our muscular energy. And as we inhale, this is like our, our organic energy. We shine out. Exhale, draw in. Draw in around your own inner light. And then inhale, Shine that light out. Now we need to do both. We need to draw in, protect our inner light. And we need to shine out. One more round. Tuck your toes under, come up to downward facing dog. Bent knee down dog to begin. And again, take a moment to feel into your hands, kind of bounce on your hands and feet, feel your foundation. And now engage your, the muscles in your arms, hug the skin to muscle, muscle to bone and hug your arms towards each other so your arms are really strong. The same with your legs, skin to muscle, muscle to bone and hug to a midline. And from your hands, imagine you're drawing energy up into your heart space, the same with your feet, draw energy from your feet up into your heart space. And now our, our organic energy from your heart, push down into your arms so you feel and you feel as if you're pushing the mat from away from you. And then from your heart, push down, push, lengthen up through your sit bones, get along through your spine and allow the energy to move down through your legs. Maybe your heels move towards the floor. Feel that expansion and fullness as you push down into the earth. Feel more grounded, more stable. Walk your hands back towards your feet. Coming into a forward fold at the back of your mat. Bend your knees here. Allow your head to hang down. And look at your feet. Make sure your feet are parallel, hip distance and parallel. Bend your knees a little, engage the muscles in your legs, find that action. Hands to your hips, elbows back, shoulders back and push down into your feet. Root down as you rise up and again this expanding out from feet down through the earth, right up through your body into your fingertips. Exhale, hands to your heart. Inhale and reach your arms up. 
Exhale, bow forward. Half lift to look forward. Bend your knees, walk your hands forward, downward dog. Inhale, come into plank pulse. Spending a few breaths here in plank. And again, feel your hands, your feet, your foundation. Engage the muscles and hug in. Find that contraction first. Draw the energy in. And now from your heart, push down into your hands so you feel just your upper back round. Feel that lengthening away. And imagine that with each breath you can expand and shine outwards here. So you can find this in every pose, no matter how challenging it is. Take a breath and downward dog. Walk your hands back towards your feet. Bend your knees, hands to your hips, shoulders back. Engage the muscles in your legs. Draw energy in and now root down. Root down from your pelvis down through your legs into your feet and then rise up from your pelvis up through your arms into your fingertips. Shine out and hands together in front of your heart. Interlace your fingers. Flip your hands and then bring your knuckles to the top of your head. Shoulder blades onto your back. Bend your knees a little, engage your legs. Imagine you're hugging to a midline, draw energy in, contract in. And now push down from your pelvis down into your feet and feel that more rootedness, that organic energy gives us that groundedness into the earth. You're pushing down into the earth. Now push up and lengthen your spine right up into your hands and expand that way. And now press your hands up towards the ceiling. Keep your shoulder blades on your back, keep your belly in, ribs in, side bend over towards the right. Inhale back to centre, over towards the left. Back to centre, one more time each side, tick tock your spine. Keep hugging your arms in, even though we're expanding out, we still keep that muscular energy going. Reach up, exhale, release your hands. Now we're going to take our belt and come to lie down on our back. Belt or a scarf. Hug your right knee in towards your chest. Keep your left leg bent with your foot on the floor just for a moment. And then lasso your foot with your belt. Keep the knee bent. And then activate this foot by drawing your toes down. That will activate the muscles, that muscular energy. And do the same then with your left leg. So expand it out, activate it, find that contraction, that drawing in, get that energy in, into your core, draw in. And then from there, now we're going to expand out, lengthen up through your heel, expand out both directions, both legs from your pelvis, lengthen up through the right heel, lengthen down through the left heel, shoulder blades onto your back. Even imagine you're getting taller up through the crown of your head. You can even see, could you imagine the width of you expanding outwards? And that's organic energy. This lovely expansion allowing us to move the energy down through our body and up through our body, out. Breathe here. and release that leg, bend both legs, maybe feel the difference in the legs and then as you draw the left foot in, activate muscular energy, right leg, lengthen it away, activate, hug in, imagine you're hugging your thighs towards each other, shoulder blades on your back, take a breath in and then from your pelvis now without losing, without pressing your toes away, without losing that activation, Lengthen from your pelvis down through the legs, out through the heels, ball of the big toe, up through the crown of the head. Breathe here. You can feel this in the back of the legs. 
a really lovely length into the hamstrings and the calf muscles. Another two rounds of the breath. and release. Swing your knees in, hug them in, massage out the lower back. Cross out your ankles, let's roll up. So we're going to do that same action at the wall. So if you want to move your mat a little bit closer to a wall and then come to hands and knees with your feet against the, um, the wall and stack your shoulders over your wrists. Settle, open into grace. Again, open into grace, get a nice long side body and roll your shoulder blades onto your back. Very important. Engage your arms, hug the muscles to the bone, hug your arms towards each other. Make your hands really strong. And then on an inhale, lift up into a, a kind of a shortened down dog. Bend your knees here, so knees are bent. Take a breath in and push down into your hands. So you push down and see, can you find more length in your spine than anything? So the knees are bent, we're taking the hamstrings out of it all together. Knees bent, feel the length up through your sit bones. Breathe here. Take another two rounds of the breath. And exhale and release. So you could do that again, and we'll add on to that. Settle into your hands, take a breath, side body long, shoulder blades onto your back. And lift up and back, short down dog. Find your strength, contract in, and then either stay here or bring your right foot up onto the wall. So my knee is bent and my foot is up in line with my hip. And take a breath in, contract in, draw in, and now push out down through your hands, but down through the length of your legs, so that bottom leg just lifts up. Breath in, and exhale and release. Take a breath in, and as you exhale, push down to the leg, push, push, push. So the left leg lifts up the floor, and exhale and release. Do that one more time. Lift up and release. Release that leg. Come down to hands and knees. Sit back onto your heels. Give your hands and your wrists a little bit of movement. But it's that organic energy. So we draw it all in. It's that organic energy that lifts us up. So you push your energy down into the wall to get that lift. Let's come back again. Hands and knees. Breath in, shoulder blades onto your back. Engage all the muscles. Come up into your short down dog. And again, this might be where you stay. Working on pushing the earth away from you, lifting your sit bones high, getting loads of length in your spine. Or step your left leg up. And see my leg is bent and my foot is in line with my hip. Take a breath in and now push down, push down, push the energy down through the legs so that bottom leg lifts and release. Do that a few times. Lift the leg, use the organic energy. Last time. And down to hands and knees, sit back onto your heels. Bring your left arm out in front, draw your fingers back your body. Do the same on the other hand. Give your arms a shake. So we're going to do it one more time. I'm going to do that action one more time. So you have three variations. You can stay in your down dog, shorten down dog, feeling that organic energy. It's a great way to feel it at the wall. And you can do your leg lifts or you can come with me into half handstand. Take a breath in. Lengthen the sides of your body, shoulder blades onto your back. Come up, shorten down dog. Then take it step by step. It's very important, don't rush. It's when we rush that we um, 
get frustrated. Lift one leg up. Push again, push down into your hand, push out to the length of the leg, and maybe the other leg will follow. Take a breath in, bend your knees here, and now push down into your hands, from your heart, push down into your hands, push the earth away, just like you do in your down dog. And from your heart, lengthen up into your sit bones, and down through the length of your legs, push your feet into the wall. Stay here for three more rounds of the breath. And then release. Come back to sit on your heels or into a child's pose. You can always pause the video here if you want to do that again. That is fun, I think. And that's what organic energy gives. It gives this sense of full, fullness and fun and kind of the cherry on the top. You really feel your energy just flowing around your body. And there's that balance of strength and the length of drawing in and expanding out. Let's make our way up to standing. I'm going to move my mat back into the centre. And come into a wide, last bit of work, wide-legged standing pose. And just check your feet are wide enough ankles underneath your wrists, hands onto your hips. Take a breath in, feel your feet, shoulders onto your back, nice long side body. And then turn your right toes towards the short edge of the mat. Heel arch alignment here, bend into your right knee. Now draw in, expanding, contracting, really strengthen and find that muscular energy in the legs. Inhale, lift your arms up. So we're drawing in from your fingertips, draw your shoulder blades onto your back. From your feet, draw energy up into your pelvis. Take a breath in and now expand out. Imagine the energy pushing down through your legs. Up through your spine, get along in your spine, out through your arms into your fingertips. Expand out, find your fullness. From a midline, can you soften out to your extremities? out to the borders of your body. Feel the breath of you, the width. Bring your right hand down, palm facing up, or right elbow down onto your thigh, palm facing up, left hand onto your hip. Parjvakanasana, reach your left arm up and over past your ear. Again, draw in, contract in, and then expand. keep that contraction in as you lengthen out. See, can you expand out even more? Express your pose from the inside out. And enjoy. Inhale and lift up. Hands to your hips, turn your right toes in, left toes out. Settle. Long side body, shoulder blades onto your back, lift your arms. From your feet, draw in, bend into your left knee. Draw energy up into your pelvis from your fingertips. Draw energy back so your shoulder blades connect with the back body. Take a breath in and now expand out, down through your legs, up through your spine, out through your fingertips. Feel full. Bend a little bit more into that front knee. Parjvakanasana, side angle pose. Left hand down, right arm reaches up and over past your ear. Go a little bit deeper into that front knee. Inhale and lift up. Release your hands, turn your toes in. Heel, toe your feet back together, give your legs a shake. So we can find organic energy in every single pose we do, every single one. Come down to a seat. You might want to sit up onto a blanket or a cushion here. Draw the toes back, 
that your that your muscular energy find strength in your legs take a breath in lengthen the side body and now lengthen out through your heels inhale and reach up lengthen up through your fingertips stay here bow forward Paschimottanasana forward fold inhale and lengthen exhale and fold and depending on how the back of the legs feel you can put a small bend into your legs take a breath in lengthen again so all this lengthening is your organic energy find length in your spine and fold Keep the feet active. Inhale and lift up. Exhale and release. Bend your right knee. Use your left knee. Cross your left foot to the opposite side of your right leg. Hug your knee and lengthen up. And either wrap your hand around your knee or bring your elbow to your outer knee and begin to turn remember turn from the back of your right ribs around back of your right lower back around then the back of your right ribs the shoulders and into a twist back to center release that leg bend the left the right knee in lengthen up shoulder blades onto your back cross that foot over take a breath in and twist around to your right side maybe your elbow can hook the outer leg the outer knee back to center let's make our way down to lie on our back hug your knees in massage out the lower back and draw the knees in lift your head find this contraction in hug in activate your feet take a breath and then slowly unravel Release your legs, your arms, shoulder blades onto your back. Allow the energy to flow now through your body. And with each breath, imagine there's a light in your heart space. And your breath is like a dimmer switch. With each breath, the light gets brighter and brighter. Allow that light to expand from the heart space. Allow it to brighten up your inner body. Each breath. Allow the light to flow down through your legs, down through your arms. Imagine the breath flowing out through the crown of your head, your toes and fingers. You imagine the light expanding out through your skin from the core of you out through your boundaries. Out through the muscles. To 
feel that expansion and fullness as you lie here. You can tap into that fullness at any time. That inner strength, that inner light that we have used in our past is always there. Just waiting for you to tap into it. Stay here for as long as feels right for you. And this is where I will meet you.